Hey guys, so, okay, I've been waiting for packages to come, uh, obviously with the time of season that it is, things are not really shipping the way that they normally would with uh, speediness, so <clears throat> I just today got my Etsy bag, so I'm going to open that with you guys today. I am actually really happy it finally came. I was starting to get worried because my Ipsy was asking me to rate my stuff and I'm like, I never got it. And I couldn't track it anymore because it was asking me to rate my stuff. I thought that the time, the time frame that it gives for it to get shipped was over. But this is Descenders. I'm really excited because the bag that we get this month is really pretty. So first I open it up and I have a card. And two things. The card says Snow Globe. During the frostiest, most festive time of the year, we find beauty inspo everywhere. Icicles, fresh blankets of snow, and twinkly holiday lights have us dreaming of iridescent nail art, crisp white eyeliner, and shimmery skin. But enough about us. What does December beauty look like for you? Post your magical wintry looks with a tag has the and tag hashtag Ipsy Snow Globe so we can all inspire each other. Because this is what Ipsy is all about. It's more than the five products handpicked for you or the cute glam bag it comes in. It's a place where you can find ideas, share your thoughts, and be yourself amongst a community that celebrates individuality and self-expression. We're changing the game one Ipsy at a time. The world is our snow globe. Let's shake it up. So that's really cool. I like um, this. This is cool. So we have two face masks here. We have, they're both pure lease. This one was all bent up, so that one might be all screwed up. I don't know. Uh, this is coconut and rice nourishing sheet mask. The other is green tea and ginger rejuvenating sheet mask. Moisturizing and soothing for the coconut, moisturizing and detoxifying for the green tea and ginger, which makes me think this one might be a painful one. We, if you've been on my channel, you know the struggle is real with face masks causing me pain. So here we go. Are you ready? This is what's really exciting. This is a beautiful, like, frosty silver with little blue accents and, and then the, the silver glitter on it. I'm really excited for this. This is like my favorite bag other than the October one. And first things first is, oh, we got a brush. This is, I don't know what those letters are, but something glam. Something Miss Glam, maybe? But it's the L36. It's got this really pretty pink handle, and the glitter seems to not come off too much. A little bit of transfer there. And it's got pink bristles with purple on the end. Oh, that's where the glitter's coming from. It's coming from inside this. But this is really soft. I do not have a brush this soft. This is my first brush that I've ever received in an Ipsy bag. I'm excited. And uh, the cats always use the litter box every time I start filming. They just went to the bathroom, I'm not even joking, but whatever. And then we have Smashbox Always On Gel Eyeliner in Fishnet. And, um, oh, oh, I don't know if you're going to be able to, because my camera, but, oh, the nice crispness of a new liner. Let's give this a little, oh, you barely have to touch that at all. Like, whoo. If it's as long lasting as the Urban Decay 24 7, then um, Urban Decay might have a run for its money because that one is freaking smooth. The next thing we have in here is um, Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick Ipsy Unzipped. And uh, it has use code Ipsy30 for 30% off. So uh, if you want to use that code for Ofra, use code Ipsy30 for 30% off on OprahCosmetics.com. So, uh, that's just right on the bottle. But, uh, it's this nice kind of like, um, I don't speak these colors. A pinky, nude-ish kind of color, I would say. Like a, a very nude, maybe. This is not a shade that I would wear. This just doesn't go well with my face. I mean, at least I don't think it goes well with my face. Why is it smell good? It's a plastic container. It's not even open. Okay. But, uh, this just isn't a color that I would normally go for. I like dramatic colors. I don't really wear nudes or like light pinks or anything like that. It's like freaking neon green and gold and you know, that whole thing. Black. Let's see how this. Ugh, that smells awful. Must just be the inside of the bag. 
let's give this a little swatch on my hand. I mean, I'm pretty sure if people are into this kind of color for a lip product that this is like awesome. I just, I'm just not for these kinds of colors, but there we go with the color of that. Now I feel like this is going to get everywhere, so I'm going to wipe it on my pants. Keep it classy on this channel. And then I think there should only be one, no, two more things. Alright, we have Pixie by Petra. Um, mesmerizing Mineral Duo in Orchid Ornament. So let's get this packaging off of this. Alright. And then, ooh, I like the shape that this is in. So this is this is what we got going here. Here, there. See that? So I'm gonna give both of these a little swatch. A one finger swatch. Ooh, that looks pretty in my finger so far. Oh! Okay, so the darker shade is probably gonna take a little bit to build up. It's pretty patchy, but that like rose gold color is to die for. Like, again, don't think my camera's gonna pick it up correctly, but you can maybe see how patchy the purple is, but how beautiful and, like, very pigmented the other one is. Like, I'm doing, I'm gonna do a subtle swatch. Got a lot of my finger over the same spot. And it's just, that you can see that there's spots that it's darker than others, and it just isn't very pigmented. But I'm really excited for that other one. I would use that as a highlight. I will use that as an eyeshadow. I will use it for my inner corners, for my brow bone. I'll just put that all over my whole face. Please and thank you. So there should be one more thing. And there's not. Aren't you supposed to get five things in your Ipsy bag? I thought that was the point of an Ipsy bag. Well, either way, I guess these are the four things that we got. Unless the face masks is a thing. They just didn't fit in the bag. Okay, so then, yeah, that's five things. So I am excited about, about these. Well, this one because it says soothing, scared of this one because it says detoxifying, and uh, I'm always down for some black liner. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of this, but I'll definitely give it a whirl because, I mean, this is what Ipsy's for. It's for trying things you wouldn't normally try. I'm really excited about this brush because I don't have a brush this size. So, I just, oh, it's got cute little rhinestones on it. I have really cheap brushes and then I have my Sephora brushes from literally more than 10 years ago. So yeah. And then this, I'm just stoked to try out that freaking rose gold color. And I love this bag. And like it feels better than the other bags I've got. It feels like, like pleather, but I mean like it's smooth and nice and I like it. And the inside is just that nice frosty blue, like this is just... Ugh. When I saw that this was going to be the bag for December, I just could not wait for it to come because this is probably my favorite looking bag. So, that's that for my Ipsy December 2017. So, the last one for 2017. And next month, we're going to get January of 2018. So, that'll be exciting. I also received my box box in the mail. It was... Um, they, they left it on the porch in the snow, so. So I'm going to unbox that next because they both came at the same time. And this one's long overdue. Longer than that. So I'm going to get right to that. I was really excited. I couldn't even, like, get myself prepared for a video because I don't normally try to look like this on these types of videos. But I just needed to get that open. So there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Make sure you subscribe down below because I'm going to be opening these Ipsy bags every single month. And because I open other things on this channel, uh, like the box box I'm about to be opening. And uh, yeah, I have another um, subscription box that I'll be opening. I got my first one this month, but I wasn't sure if I wanted to record it. But I think next month I'm going to for sure because I'm really happy about what I got. But enough about that. Basically, subscribe because there's a lot of stuff happening. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.